chief of police or and some dignitaries are coming out here right now there you can see uh, Jim Waring and Sergeant Trent Crump is on your right hand side he is one of the public information officers from the Phoenix Police Department you will also hear from Chief Daniel Garcia they are stepping up to the podium right now Good afternoon, folks. We'll uh, start in three seconds here. You ready? Yeah. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Um, seems that today started with a very tragic day and a very violent day for the city of Phoenix. Earlier this morning, we had an officer-involved shooting. Luckily, none of our officers were hurt, but uh, unfortunately, we were un unable to escape a, a day of tragedy for the city of Phoenix and the Phoenix Police Department. This afternoon, approximately an hour ago, we had two officers shot. Thank you, sir. One of our officers has uh, succumbed to the injuries and passed away approximately 30 minutes ago. It's a very difficult time for the Phoenix Police Department and the city of Phoenix. On behalf of our mayor, Greg Stanton, and our vice mayor, Jim Waring, who's with me here today, our hearts go out to both families of officers. Uh, right now, as I said earlier, one of our officers has died from his injuries and the other officer is uh, in surgery fighting for his life. I ask the citizens of Phoenix to keep both families and officers in their prayers. It's a very difficult time for our department. Our officers this morning were, uh, this afternoon, were serving a felony warrant, uh, and there was an exchange of gunfire. And um, as far as the investigation, it's still very fresh, still going. Again, I ask the citizens of Phoenix to please pray for both families of the officers, pray for our officer who's still in surgery, and please pray for our officer who was killed on the line of duty today. This is uh, this is the worst part of of policing, the hard part for policing, the tragic part of policing, and the part that uh, always strikes a chord not only for our officers in relation to losing a fellow officer, but for our citizens and I know for City Hall. Again, please keep our officers both in your prayers as we continue to move forward. Good afternoon. Chief, what can you tell us about the officer? Can you tell us an age or how long you've been with the department? The only thing I'll say, the officer that was killed today, that he had been on the department for 21 years. Thank you, sir. How are the guys doing?